YouTube, it is Lego World War II Maker here again, and today I am giving you my Lego store haul. Um, last night, which was Friday, my aunt took me to the Lego store, and I got quite a few things. So, first I got this, um, like, make your own minifigure thing, make your own minifigure thing, because I needed, like, more tank crew. So I just used the tank crew or whatever. I got tan legs for some future, like, Africa Corps soldiers. Um, so let me open this up for you guys. They're all the same, except different accessories. Um, and while the heads were there, all three of them have the classic city head. Like the old time classic city head. Second one. And there's the third one. Just thought I'd pick a few of those up because they're they're like the classic like smiling heads. So those are those, so I'll make good use out of them in my mock. In the mock I've added another building. Another building. And over here I've added some more like rubble. And whatnot on the little blown out house. It's gonna be the two green base plates, or at least extending out to there. So yeah. So that's gonna be that. Um crap, just I gotta snap this together quick. There we go. Um I picked up four Simpsons Simpsons minifigures. I got two Barts, which kinda sucks, but on the back it's got a slingshot, which like connects with the pants piece. I, I really don't like this figure because it's just, like, really basic on the front and the legs. The only th detailing about him is, like, his short sleeve shirt and, like, the slingshot. That's, like, about it with him. And he comes with a skateboard with, like, red stripes. I got Millhouse. He's got that little, like, dome with... I choo choo choose you like for Valentine's Day and then got a little polo shirt on with a belt and regular like brown mini pants. Yep, it's Millhouse and then I got Ned Flanders, the neighbor. He comes with a I Heart South Paws mug, a toolbox, and their heads are actually really cool because um they're like custom molded. Then he has a green like sweater with a pink undershirt. Um, but here comes the jewel of mine. This, this thing. Um, I got this for like a mock, like a Pacific mock. Um, you guys are probably thinking, but wait a minute, you're gonna finish this mock? Yeah, yeah, I am going to finish this mock, but it might be a little shorter than what I wanted it to be. Like, it's not gonna be four green base plates, but it's definitely gonna be like. Actually, it might only be like this, like that part, and then this, and then like, yeah, it's only going to be two, gre two um, three green base plates and then two gray, so it's going to be a nice little mock, but it's actually going to be a very decent size. So in here, the pick-a-brick wall, they actually had a lot of things that I could use, so I got a few pink tiles because pink is a rare color in Lego. So I got like pink tiles, um, dark pink bricks, and there's light pink, like light pink, like that color. Um, I got little stacks. I got stacks of 16 bricks to fit like more. I got like stacks of 16 and brown and tan in there. So I got quite a few stacks, like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven stacks. I got this tub of like old fashioned, um, like tropical leaves that Lego had. I got a whole small cup of those for the trees. So I have like a lot of these like old timey leaves, full cup. And now here's the part. That you've all that I've been waiting to show you guys a whole small tub of a translucent just studs one by one studs for the water. I don't know how many are in here, but it's quite a few. Um, 
So this would be used for the water in my Pacific mock that I'm going to be making. And yeah, I don't know. I'm going to end up counting these. So wish me luck, guys, on that. Um, my new channel, Frosty Snipes, is actually up. I have a video up, Killing, killing Them on Cargo. So if you could go check that one out, um, I would really much appreciate it, guys. And I will see you guys tomorrow.